Well, Andy, uh, three points against Falkenberg, and we deserved it. Yeah, yeah, we deserved the, the win today. I thought that we, I thought that we played very well for the first 25, 30 minutes, and then they had a period at the end of the first half where uh, they put us under a little bit of pressure, won some corners. We didn't pretend, uh, defend them particularly well, um, but I thought that um, I thought in the first half we'd done well. And then I thought at the start of the second half, they came out much better than we did. Um, but I thought we finished the game extremely strongly in the last 25. So I think that, you know, um, it was a well-deserved victory. I'm delighted for uh, Le Casso, Yassine and Hani, just to mention three, because, you know, Hani's been outstanding in the three games this season, playing in centre midfield. Gives us something that we haven't got outstanding goal and of course we're just waiting for Yassin to get fit really uh, he didn't train from November through to February so he's a little bit behind but he's got that quality when he comes off the bench and I'm not being Mr Clever Clogs after the event but I said to him before the game today be ready for the last 30 minutes because I really thought that he could be the person that could turn the game in our favour and his goal was magnificent you know we got four points maybe you know, in the cold light of day, we would have taken four from those first very tough three games that we had. All teams that uh, think they're going to be in Super Etan next year. Um, but, you know, you look back and you think, well, you know, we should have beat Young Sheila. We might have six points. But, um, listen, we're, we're delighted and it's a great, uh, great result and a, and a great performance for, for, for long periods. You mentioned uh, both Hani's goal and uh, Yasin's goal. And then we had the, the first goal from uh, Albin. Yeah, brilliant. Um, I mean, Albin's a goal scorer. You know, we've got, I've said it before, you know, and I'll, I'll, I don't want to keep repeating because I've no doubt that we'll go five games and don't score, but we've got goals. I mean, Marcus Johansson, we just can't get him in the team at the moment. And he, you know, he came on and, and did very well when he came on. Um, we've got goals in the team. Albin's a natural scorer. Marvin, I thought, had another super game today. I thought he was very, very difficult to play against, and that's what I want the strikers to be. Um, and I thought those two up top in the first half were outstanding. And like I say, Yassin just gives us something that we've never had. He's a, he's a player who he understands how we press. He's willing to do it. He can do it quickly. And when, he's get, when he gets on the ball, he's a real threat. You know, he can go past people and he makes forward runs. So, um, great. Some real good performances. Don't like singling people out, really. But I think it's, uh, it's right that uh, they get a mention because... You know, when we made the changes from the bench, they were all they were all positive changes, and that's what you want to do. You know, there are players that could argue with me and say they should be playing, and I would have to agree with them. But that's the that's the difference in what we've got uh, that we haven't had before is that we've got a little bit more strength in depth. People are going to be sat on the bench that I could say, I'm, you know, I'm I, I'm actually sorry because on a on a different day with a different team and a different tactical plan, we would we would you would be playing. They've all approached it fantastic. There's been no sulking. So very, very proud of them today. And the defence? We've got things to work on, but we did look a little bit more solid. We did defend with a little bit more resilience. Um, they resorted to putting their centre back up and kicking long balls. So, of course, that's a different problem than how they played in the rest of the game. So, um, yeah, we're, we're happy. We move on and we look forward to the next game. Mm -hmm.